Here we are at part 8 of my video walkthrough for Final Fantasy Mystic Quest. And we are in the Ice Pyramid. Hmm. Yay, look at that. A sword will open those up. Now this first floor is kind of mazy, kind of big. But uh, we want to start off by going to the very far right. Hey! I didn't see that dude standing there. What's up with that? Yes, and inside here we have Desert Hags. It's an old enemy, but eh, decided to show you anyway. Because the battle music just rocks. Alright, anyway. Hey, I didn't see those dudes either. Hmm, something fishy is going on. It's Lamias! We fought them before, and they are weak to thunder! Alright, the magic mirror. This will allow us to see the enemies in the ice pyramid. Otherwise, they're all invisible. At least the ones on the first floor are, I think. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, it takes a little bit to uh, explore our way through here. Lots and lots of enemies. Oh, well, nothing that way. I guess that dude was just guarding an empty passage. Hey, and here's something we haven't fought in here before. It's mages! We got, I think we fought them out on the battlefield before coming in here. They can cast Silence and Cure and Blizzard. Moving up the floor. Sphinx and Fanquids. Sphinxes can confuse. Very aggravating. Do not like them. Aw, oh, awesome. Jumbo Bomb can take them out. Alright, level up. Some heal potions. That's all there is for that passage. Some refreshers and some more arrows. They give you lots of arrows and whatnot, so. Some more Lamias. Alright, now this is a very, very crowded floor of enemies. Lots of stuff to kill. Including some new enemies. Stony Roost. And by the sound of them, they can petrify. They have Petro Touch. If you touch them, they will petrify you. Um, Phoebe has a ranged weapon, so we don't have to worry about it. And if you use bombs with Benjamin, then uh, you'll also be protected from it. If they die, they can't Petro Touch you. So. have to worry about attacking them when they're weak. Yeah, I'm not sure what I was looking at exactly there. Anyway, clearing out some more enemies. Alright, some arrows. Wow, she's just kind of running out. It's at 53 right now. Let's head up to the third floor for a minute. Where we have some new enemies. It's Gathers. They are weak to explosions. Seems like a good time to heal myself. And the Jumbo Bomb should kill both of them. So, 
Awesome. And here we have a freezer crab. Like most crab enemies, they are weak to axe, axe type attacks. All right. Some more arrows, heal potions. And that's all for the treasures there. Got one last treasure we want to grab on our way out here. With some more arrows. Yay! Yeah, anytime you see one of them blue statue things, you can stab them with a sword and probably activate some kind of a switch. Yes, lots of winding passages. Lots of going up floors and going down floors. Took me a while to figure out a good route through here. <coughs> Alright, I managed to get Phoebe back up to 80 arrows. <laughs> but at least she's not running out, right? And yeah, there's nothing off to the right, so let's head up here. Fight some more stony roost and get some more arrows. Excellent. I think this just about clears the first floor off. Yay! Oh boy, there, making sure we don't run out of arrows. I think we've got like 50 or 60 so far. <laughs> Alright, up to the third floor. Ooh. Bunches of new enemies. Exciting stuff here. Alright, again, more arrows. More freezer crabs, more gathers, more arrows. Wow, she's up to 97. Good grief. Yes, we do have to open that. Make sure you remember to go open that. And now we gotta walk our way back. Well, apparently I hit level 16 somewhere along the road. Taking them out, taking them out. Alright, got some more treasure. Arrows and explosives. And she's at 98, so. I'm not wasting any just yet. And up to floor four. Ooh, there's one of them fancy treasure chests. But we'll get into that middle area there in a little bit. We just need to go around for now. Yeah, I decided to throw this in because it was a new grouping. Sphinxes and gatherers. Hope that jumbo bomb will take him out. Aw, oh, boo. It didn't. But Phoebe cannot kill a sphinx on her own. So, I don't think. Ha ha ha. His self-destruct killed him, though. Oh, man. I am beat down here. Yay, she didn't kill us. Ow, I am hurting. 